A lot of people are nice. You meet them for the first time, and they give you directions, spare some change, and even give you a lift. Some others are not really nice, but pretend to be because of an agenda. You need to be able to spot them and avoid them. Such people try to become friends with people to gain some benefit or advantage. They are very unpleasant people who nobody should really be friends with. In this video, I will share with you 13 signs of fake people you need to avoid. 1. They make commitments they seldom keep. Fake nice people have an agenda for being nice. They therefore overdo it. They are unnaturally nice. They promise to do things for a lot of people to maintain their public image and almost always never keep them. The funny thing is that, to them, it doesn't even matter. As long as you are not their target, they do not feel obliged to please you or act nice towards you. They can greet you today and completely ignore you tomorrow as though they never met you. They are hardly friends with others. If you know a guy who never says he has a lot of commitments and cannot do you a favor, be careful. He may well be one of those people. No one is ever so free they can do favors for everyone. Anyone who claims to be is either jobless or is accepting to help for a show. 2. They try to make people like them. While most reasonable people can aspire for social acceptance and sometimes validation, fake nice people do not just want any of this. They want people to like them. They have hidden agendas that people lacking them can help them achieve. They go out of their way to make their targets happy and pretend to be friends with them. The more the person likes them, the easier it is to propagate their agenda. They are two-faced people that really do not care. You actually need to avoid such people. If someone you have not known for a long time suddenly starts acting too nice, be careful. They may have a hidden agenda. Ordinary people do not need people to like them. They are really okay if their loved ones appreciate them. 3. The Shed Crocodile Tears People can be quite tricky to read. Fake nice people who want to sympathize over your loss may cry crocodile tears to make their concerns appear real. Crocodile tears are not real tears, really, because they do not care. Don't be surprised to find such a person laughing a few minutes after the whole incident. It takes a lot of emotions to cry. Anyone who acts contrary to grief in such circumstances is likely a fake friend who merely pretends he was sorry for your loss. They may even shed a tear when they talk about how they met you and speak of your accolades to further endear you to them. You need to be careful with such people. 4. They are bad liars. Have you ever had someone around you who always seemed bored whenever you brought up a topic that didn't directly or indirectly relate to them? They seldom listen. They mostly hear bits and pieces of what others say and only really pay attention when it concerns their agenda. This is a clear sign that someone might be a fake nice person. People want to be heard. If you act so nice but cannot spend 5 minutes listening to someone, it means that you think it is not in line with your plan. 5. They have hidden agendas for being friends with them. Imagine someone being friends with you to get closer to your sister. How would you feel if you found out? That is precisely how fake nice people operate. They can be friends with you for a political purpose, for an academic purpose, or even a business purpose. The list is endless. Try to ask questions when dealing with people you did not know before. Ask them about their dreams, visions, and goals. What they tell you will help you determine what types of people they are and whether or not you should be hanging out with them. 6. They treat influential people well. Fake nice people tend to treat influential people well. The test of a man's character is not how he treats his mayor or governor, it is how he treats his servants that determines. Many fake nice people mistreat people. They are condescending and have no problem calling out the faults of people who are not their targets. They are pleasant to the people they want something from. 7. They criticize and laugh at others. Fake nice people laugh at people a lot. They are sarcastic sometimes and generally do not care whose feeling it hurts. They also criticize a lot. Getting laughed at is normal, really. It is something everyone experiences at one point or another. If a fake nice person actually does not understand what he wants from you, you're next in line for condescending remarks and being laughed at. It is a horrible thing to laugh at people. We have all had moments we are not proud of, what we want to have been laughed at. 8. They act with a false sense of concern. A fake nice friend can actually call you often to check on you. They can accompany you to the library and hang out with you during the weekends. Sometimes, it feels very amazing and you really do not want it to stop. You need to wake up. What is the good of having a buddy who never really actually cared about you, but merely pretended because he needed something from you? If you are observant, you can tell when the call is routine and when your friend actually checks on you. You can also tell when a person volunteers to help out. After all, 
They think they are supposed to, and when they do, it's because they genuinely want to help. 9. They hide their emotions. Fake nice people are practiced pretenders. They have perfected to some extent the skill of hiding their emotions. There are, however, some who tell tales that can give them away if one pays close attention. The first one is when they smile. Their eyes do not have any creases. Smiling genuinely uses more face muscles than fake smiles. By observing their eye region, we can tell whether their smile is genuine or fake. Therefore, determine if they are fake nice people. If they are with you and they say they are comfortable, watch their hands or legs. If they are trapping on the surface, it means they are actually impatient and cannot wait to live. 10. They seek attention. It is only natural that people who want to be noticed should seek attention. They want to be the center of attention, and this can be irritating sometimes. They want to be noticed so that they can attract the attention of their targets and endear them to themselves. This may not always work. Meeting people at bars is excellent. However, you cannot really call anyone a friend until after a while. Avoiding this type of person means really defining who your friends are and what your expectations of them are. 11. They put others down to look good. To remain the center of attention, sometimes they may smear the image of one or two people. People involved are seen as collateral damage. They are quite a terrible set of people. They are only interested in their agendas and very little else matters. 12. They undertake in humble bragging. In seeking attention, they engage in humble bragging. This actually makes people dislike them, but they probably don't care. They say they can't run when they have won prizes for sprinting professionally. They even say they don't read, but go on to quote Homer. It can be pretty annoying. 13. They are not loyal. Fake nice people are one of the most disloyal sets of people you can ever meet. Because their associations with people are tied to an agenda. Once those agendas are met, the relationship comes to an end. It doesn't matter what the other party is going through at the moment. They couldn't care less, really. Observe your acquaintances. Is there anyone you did a favor who doesn't even say hi to you anymore? I bet there are a lot. Learn to avoid such people. All they do is take. They are not interested in investing in you. Fake nice people are what they are. Fake. They are really not nice people, so beware. As long as you keep an eye out for fake smiles, people who always seem eager to please and reveal very little information about themselves should be fine. If this video inspired you, subscribe to our channel. We love you.